Hi, my name is Tyler Keel, and I'm going to do the exterior of the Cadillac XTS Platinum Edition. Uh, as you can see, the grill, uh, similar to the uh, CTS, has the uh, Xenon adaptive headlights for uh, high and low beam when it gets dark at night. Front and rear uh, driving assist cameras. The whole thing is about 202 inches long. It has the uh, chrome wheels that are about 22 inches. It has the LED lights and the uh, mirrors right here. Also, LED lights on both on all the door handles. If you follow me to the back here, you'll notice that the uh, uh, XDS has the V shape going down all across the, uh, the other back of the vehicle. And once again, the uh, driving assist uh, assist damage. What I like is how this uh, clear brake light acts as a spoiler. And now we'll go ahead and pop the hood. Your basic uh, V6 engine with direct injection, fuel injection system. And now we'll go ahead with the interior. This has 304 horsepower, it has 28 on the highway, 17 on the city. Goes from zero to sixty in six point four seconds. Uh, the lights, when you turn, they change uh, with your car. So if you're turning left, the light beams will also turn left too. It's a safety feature that this car has, with a, also a four-star rollover and a five-star all-around. Alright, I'm Ryan Holton and I'm going to show you the interior of the 2013 Cadillac XTS. Right here, to start off, we have the LED accented door handles <clears throat> with the integrated keyless touch system, which you press once, it'll lock the door, and then twice, it'll unlock all doors so you can access it. And then right as you can see, we have the wood grain accented with the aluminum. And it also comes with the jet black interior. We have two seat settings here that you can set. The trunk hatch with the storage pocket. Then we got the tense adjustable seat right here with the leg pull out manual. Alright, now we have the Cadillac Q system, which we have the dash system right here, and then we also have a 12 inch display. This is the balanced display. There's uh, four different modes you can go to. For the display layout, we have simple, performance, enhanced, and also it comes with a heated steering wheel right here with the wood trim going down and the chrome accents which also flow all over um, let's see. we have there's a lot of settings you can choose on here if you go to the right pod you have your navigation phone and radio then if you go to the center you have your main settings you have your direction 
And then also you can have your navigation right in the center. And then go into the left pod. Why doesn't this show anything? Well, moving on, it's got a push start, as you can see. Let's wait for this to start back up again. To get back home, there's a home button right here. And for the display, it shows all your audio, phone, nav settings. You can scroll over. The car is pretty much customizable. And if you go to nav, and wait a second, all the option bars on top and bottom will disappear after a short period of time, around 15 seconds. And then once you want them to reappear, all you have to do is put your hand in front of it and it will all turn on. The knobs down here you can also control. Let's go back home. We'll go to the climate. There's a dual climate in this car so you can change the driver and passenger heating. You have all your modes right here. You can also change the temperature. From down here or in the fan speed on here and if you don't want to use the touch screen you can also just go back down to the touch pad we'll go all right and now up here we have the rear sun visor which once you press it the sun visor in the back will go up <coughs> giving you shade or privacy there's also the sun visors on the side, right here, if you can pull them up or down for privacy and shade. Also the panoramic sunroof, which in the Platinum is standard. And then the Platinum also comes with a Bose audio system with 14 speakers. You go to the radio. media you can change your iPod anything then we got then we have the center console which down in here you have the USB you have USB and SD ports with also a lot of storage room right there and also you got the integrated cup holders with more storage over here and also a 12 volt charge and also if you press that it comes up with a USB port we'll put that back down alright and also some more safety features on this once you put it in reverse we got the rear cam and it the seats actually vibrate on either side whichever actions happening on that side and if you turn the wheel it'll show you your path and it also shows it up on the 12 inch display Alright, and also with the 2013 XTS, it has a six-speed transmission, which you can go, which it has a drive mode, which is automatic, and then there's also a manual mode. And in the manual mode, there's paddle shifters on the back of the steering wheel, where you can change gears. And also, to top it all off, there's the ambient lighting, which goes all along here on the door panels, and also goes throughout the back. And now I'll show you the back. Alright, and in the back.
back seat. As you can see, there's a lot of room. Also, you can get to the trunk by folding the seats down. Both sides do fall down as that goes up. In the center here, we have a little center console and also a little opening to get to the trunk if needed. And then that's it for the all-new 2013 Cadillac XTS. Special thanks to Mercado, uh, Cadillac, GMC, and Buick for letting us show you guys the all-new 2013 Cadillac XTS Platinum Edition. Oh,